Hello family, happy new year and welcome back to another week's video. Today I decided to go into Target and Home Goods to check out their Valentine's decor and decoration. I was pleasantly surprised to the items I found. You know I love to decorate and style my tear tray using faux desserts and to find them at $3, you cannot beat that price. I was not feeling the faux cake one, but I could not keep my eyes off the sliced strawberry cheesecake. Look at this here. It is so beautiful. Look at the attention to detail. I, they have a beautiful cheesecake with a strawberry and whipped cream on top. So you know, it came home with me. Matter of fact, I purchased two of them. My eye was also drawn to the faux cupcake. I really like that one too. I like the attention to detail on it with the beautiful red heart at the top and the whipped cream. Well, you know, it came home with me as well. I had so many ideas flowing through my head how I can incorporate them on my tear tray or in my kitchen. Well, I want to take this time to welcome you to my channel. I am Shauna LaCale, and if you are stopping by for the first time, I would like to extend a warm welcome and invite you to subscribe to my channel, and I would love to have you to be a part of our family. These cheese boards are perfect, very inexpensive for you to display in your kitchen. And I believe they were $5 a piece. And they also have one that was in this um, shape of a heart. And if you don't like the wooden um, texture, you can always uh, spray paint it or hand paint it to your color of choice. Beautiful, they are. I was pleasantly surprised to see these beautiful Lazy Susans. They are very nice and you definitely can style them any type of way you want in your kitchen, your bedroom, your bathroom. They're the perfect small size as well as this wicker tray. Now your girl was on the hunt for this um, bar cart tear tree stand. I've been looking for it and it's finally arrived in my local store and I definitely picked that up. I started having um, different things running through my head. I definitely would like to unscrew the bottom parts and take those um, shelves out and spray paint them. But the weather here in Georgia has been very wicked so I don't think I'm gonna be able to get out there anytime soon and these are plant stands but guess what you can use them as risers around your kitchen your bathroom anywhere also you know what I like to do spray paint spray paint it can be spray painted to a color of your liking and if you see them make sure you pick them up If you're enjoying this type of video, make sure you give me a big thumbs up.
I like these reefs. They are very nice and inexpensive, but my favorite one, and I held it upside down, it's X and O. I like that reef. I think that is really cute for Valentine's. Here's another plant stand, but I feel they can be used as risers. And it's a set of two for $5. Now these are too cute. They are risers in the shape of a heart. You're gonna get a large one and a small one. They come in two different colors. Now you know they came home with me. When I turned the corner and I saw these Valentine crates sitting here, oh boy, all kind of things start running through my head. Um, I did some Christmas crates, so if you have not seen that video, I'll definitely leave the link to it in my description box. Now, make sure you pick up a couple of these because I definitely will be giving you some ideas on how to style these for Valentine's. Now, I would pick up a damaged one. I'm so sorry about that. I can see where it got scraped right there on that metal. But it's a cute little mailbox, and they also have it in a light powdered pink. And I thought this heart tear tray was very cute. I also picked this one up, so I'll definitely be sharing some ideas on how to style this beauty as well. Now they have a set of measuring um, spoons in the shape of a heart. I really like that. That's really nice and unique. Um, they are $3. And then they also have the plates that are sitting next to them. They're made of plastic. So you get a small set with two for $3. Or the one that's sitting next to it, which is the largest size, that one is also for $3. Now, you can use these to decorate your table for Valentine's. Matter of fact, I think you can use them for a tablescape. Just giving you ideas as well as to put candy on. Now these um, little tear tray signs, they only had a pack of two there of the same one. And I was like, where is the rest? There's gotta be more. And that was all I saw in the store. So they are perfect for size for a tear tray and you get three in a pack for $3. You best believe I will be back looking for more because I know that's not all what they have. So that's one set that I did pick up and I left the other one for someone else. And here's another um, tray you can use if you want to, to decorate. I think it's really nice size for $3. That's not bad. So I did end up putting that particular one right in my shopping cart.
thought these little glass candy jars with a heart lid are cute and they were $5. I found these beautiful stack books for a hot cocoa bar. We are still in winter time, so you can still be able to create a winter hot cocoa bar. And I definitely will be um, adding one to mine. Now, I didn't get the stack books, but I did get this one. It came with its very own easel and the sign says hot chocolate bar. And I thought that was cute for $3. Very nice. So make sure you go ahead and grab you some. If you don't have a sign, go ahead and grab one and make you a hot cocoa bar. Now this here, I thought this um, popcorn machine was really cute. It comes in white as well as the red and it's for $5. Very nice. That is all that I found in my local Target. So then I went on to Home Goods, and boy, did I find some beautiful Valentine gifts. Now, do you see this um, love sign? It's made out of um, ceramic with that block. I love that. I purchased that and picked it up and brought it home. Now, these beautiful red glass vase are beautiful. They are $14.99 and now that I'm looking back at them, I should have picked me up a couple of them. They're definitely a great home decor to, you know, just add some pop of red in my home. So I may have to go back and pick those, at least pick two of them up, but I'm not sure. And then I turned around and I saw some Ray Dunn. Now I did a tear tray last year because I did get that love letter mug. And I did a tear tray called Love Letters. And I am excited about probably bringing that back along with some other things for um, my tear tray. Definitely hit up your um, home goods and check them out. They do have some really nice mugs as well as canisters and JP. So I definitely will be sharing a Valentine's tear tray with you guys coming soon. I remember last year there was definitely a shortage of the JP um, anything that's JP it was a shortage but this year I was seeing it during the holidays and I'm still seeing um, some JP's so we're definitely stocked with these items in the store now and I do have a mug set like that so you will be seeing a um, tear tray with a couple pieces of my JP that I have. I don't have a lot, but I'm definitely going to incorporate it into a tear tray.
I decided to take a little stroll down the home section and for kitchen and I was looking to see if I could find some placemats but I didn't see anything that I really like so but maybe you might like something that you see I hope you do I want to thank you for uh, clicking on today's video and taking this little walk through with me in Target as well as Home Goods. I will see you guys in my next video. Have a blessed week. Bye bye. Take it to your bed.